because of smart machines and automation and you know, intelligent, I call it IA, not AI, intelligent assistance, right? Everything will change. I mean, it's basically, I mean, look, for example, when I'm researching, uh, let's say the future of shipping transportation, right? I research, I read, I watch things, and, and sometimes I use a tool where I just ask a question and then I get an answer from the AI. You know, and that is very useful. And basically every routine that can be done by a machine will be done by a machine. Right? And that is including things like, like uh, doing a dental implant, you know, if, if, if you have the nerve for that, for the machine to do that, right? Or, or, or scanning your skin for melanoma or, you know, and so on. But human ingenuity is based on all the senses that we have, you know? And it's like, you can't replace a doctor with an AI just because you have a machine scanning the skin, you know? Uh, it's a powerful tool for a doctor. So what's really happening here is as routine becomes uh, computerized and, and done by machines, our time is being unlocked to do other things on top of the machine, you know? So for example, the doctor can make the rounds in the hospital and he is, has the AI showing all the possible variations and cases and new solutions and, you know, in real time as he goes, right? And that allow, allows the doctor to actually talk to the patient, right? The doctor doesn't have to go to the computer and type in the keyword and look for things, you know? And, and that's a great thing.